Hello and welcome to another Lego parts review. This is a really small set and it is the Easter Bunny House. 57 pieces and it's set number 853990. First up you get a special box. So this, this part slides underneath. This is all the information on it, all the boring stuff. If you open it upright, you could take this off, throw it away, and then you have this cute little box. This is a perfect little Easter gift, a little basket stuffer thing for Lego. You can write to who it's from, who it's to, blah, blah, blah. Cute, nice little print all around, and it doesn't isn't really distracted by much information at all. So that's kind of neat, but let's get into the parts. First up, we get this chicken who lays the eggs so you can paint them later. Um, nice standard white chicken. Nothing too special there. Um, you also get one of these scooters, which is what our Easter Bunny friend is going to use to deliver the eggs. Unfortunately, those are fairly common, so not too special. Here is our Easter Bunny, and you can see it's kind of got a cute face, which is a nice little print, an interesting shirt, little pony or a little bunny tail on the back, which is pretty cool. And then you have the cute head part which I like how they actually did the pink for the ears. I think that makes it all so much better. But a nice little figure, nothing overly special. For unique parts, you get two of these little one-by-one -one trapezoid type toppers, which are great for little micro-build house roofs. You get a printed little egg. You get some of these, which are nice to get. You get two of the black ones, which are like the like clip angle things and their topper is in brown which is kind of unique and nice to get um you get a couple other brown pieces this is kind of neat i don't think these are too common um you get some of these one by two rounded which are kind of neat you get one of these which is just kind of another like little trapezoid type triangle thing not a trapezoid know your shapes Okay, and then you get two two by four red tiles, nothing special there. You get some nice greenery, which is pretty cool. And you get a bunch of these, which represent the eggs. Um, I think it's a nice use for them, and it's kind of a nice part to get because it's kind of a little unique part. Um, you get some flowers, some other kind of tan parts. You obviously get a carrot. You have to have a carrot, right? Um, these are the tires to the thing, just kind of the standard Standard stuff. So there's not a whole lot in here. There are some unique parts, which are not that bad. Um, overall, I feel it's a little expensive. You get one minifigure for $8. Um, and you get some pieces. I mean, the, the, I feel that this should be a $5 set. I mean, the box is smaller. The, the plastic's different that the parts come in for some reason. <laughs> I don't know why that is. But I feel this should just be a smaller set. Um or a smaller price set. Uh, I think $5 would be great. $4.99 sounds like a great price point, just under $5. But maybe the printing on the cardboard is a little bit too much for them to go that low. But I, I feel this is a little expensive. I mean, you get an okay amount of parts, but it feels a little expensive. Um, so overall, if you are interested in having the bunny figure, or you think the parts are worth it to you, you might want to go out and pick this up. Otherwise, I kind of feel it's a little expensive. I picked it up because I was curious. I didn't get a whole lot of these. Um, kind of little holiday sets, you could say. Um, and it's a th cute theme, admittedly. Um, but I think it's a little expensive. I think it should be like $5 maybe. But that's really all I got to say about this. Thank you for watching. And I will see you in the next video as this bunny hops away. Thanks for watching. Subscribe and leave a like if you want to. I hope you do. And I will see you in the next video.